It's time to clean your liver. Top 10 Liver Detox Food That You Need The liver has a significant importance in the human and without this organ. The human body would not be able to function correctly. According to the liver weighs approximately 1.5 kilograms and has a red and brown color. This organ is made of two primary parts, known as the left and right lobes. Underneath the liver, there is a gallbladder, where the intestines and pancreas are also found. All of the organs in this region work together to ensure food can be digested and to make sure the body properly processes and absorbs vital nutrients that the body needs to stay healthy. The liver is important because it filters blood that runs through the body's digestive tract to ensure chemicals are detoxified and drugs are metabolized. With such a function, the liver is also prone to becoming less functioning the more it filters through blood. In this post, we'll take a look at the best liver detox foods that you should include in your diet to keep your liver clean and to function properly at all times. Symptoms of a toxic liver. As the liver filters blood. It can be damaged consistently and become toxic. When this happens, the liver does not function properly. And numerous symptoms can start to develop. Before we look at foods that can be used to detox your liver. Let's first consider the symptoms and signs that might mean your liver has too many toxins stored up inside of it. Reports that bloating in the abdominal area is a common symptom. As well as discomfort in the area where the liver is located. If the liver contains a lot of toxins. The area may also start to become painful. Furthermore, a pot belly, heartburn, excessive sweating and weight gain that is unexpected can also be signs of a toxic liver. Some people also develop dark spots on their skin. These spots are sometimes called liver spots. And some people find that digesting foods that contain a lot of fat becomes more difficult when their liver is not functioning properly. If you experience any of these symptoms, then be sure to read on as we'll discuss some of the best foods for body detoxification and for reducing toxin buildup in the liver. A toxic liver can be harmful to your overall health and even result in pain and discomfort. Fortunately, having a toxin buildup in your liver does not mean you simply have to live with the symptoms that you are experiencing. We have compiled a list of the 10 top foods that you can consume to detox your liver and make it work properly once again. If you are planning to go on a liver detox diet, then including organic carrots in your diet should be essential. Carrots have the ability to not only detoxify your liver, but they can also completely cleanse your liver, thus providing a significant boost in liver function. Juicing for Health recommends consuming around 2-3 to three carrots per day. But, should you be diabetic, the consumption of carrots should rather be limited to only one per day. Carrots are high in vitamin A, vitamin C, vitamin D, vitamin E, potassium magnesium, phosphorus, biotin and various other essential nutrients that are not only healthy for your liver, but also for your entire body. If you don't like to eat carrots raw, try to make a carrot juice in your blender by mixing carrots, lemon juice, and fresh ginger. Spinach is part of the leafy green vegetable family and has quite a reputation for being one of the best plant-based sources of protein. But this plant has many other nutrients that are healthy for the body. The nutrients can help to neutralize all sorts of substances in the liver, including chemicals, heavy metals and more. Spinach contains vitamin, vitamin B1, zinc, choline, protein, vitamin B6, vitamin K, iron, magnesium, folate, copper and many other beneficial nutrients. If you're feeling a little adventurous, why not try the spinach salad with warm bacon dressing from the Food Network? Broccoli is an extremely healthy vegetable type. It is rich in diendolomethane, which certain studies have proved to be beneficial in the prevention of cancers that are related to having high estrogen levels. Nutrition Facts also reports that broccoli contains compounds that activates the detoxifying enzymes of the liver, and that the effects of broccoli consumption can last for several weeks after the vegetable has been consumed. Broccoli is also a good source of vitamin A, vitamin B1, omega-3 fatty acids, calcium, selenium, protein, and iron. Garlic is a herb that we often used in our cooking. It is also known as a powerful antioxidant and antibacterial compound. What many people fail to realize is that garlic also contains certain compounds that can produce active certain liver enzymes that are responsible for flushing harmful toxins out of the human body. The fact that garlic contains allicin further helps to reduce toxin buildup in the liver and improve liver function. 
Tomatoes are good for numerous health concerns, including a liver that has too many toxins stored up. The food is rich in a compound known as lycopene, which is a powerful all-natural antioxidant. Livestrong explains that the lycopene content in tomatoes also works on a DNA level to detoxify the body. The food also contains vitamin C, vitamin A, vitamin E and many other antioxidants that further helps to detox the liver. Apples are very important for a liver to cleanse as they should not only be consumed as part of your detoxification diet but also before starting your liver cleanse. Explains that apples contain malic acid, which ensures the ducts that are situated in the liver are open so that the liver can be flushed more effectively during the cleanse. Avocados are not only delicious but also considered to be a superfood. They contain a large number of nutrients, including vitamin K, vitamin B5, vitamin E, vitamin C, folate, potassium, vitamin A, magnesium and more. They also contain compounds that increase the body's natural production of glutathione, which is a substance inside the body that helps to flush toxins out of the liver. Grapefruit has quite a large number of benefits. It is high in fiber, vitamin C, lycopene, choline, and potassium, as well as many other healthy nutrients. It is an excellent choice of food for supporting heart health and also has a positive impact on triglyceride and blood lipid levels. Apart from these benefits, the antioxidants found in this fruit can also help to flush harmful toxins out of the liver and improve the efficiency of a liver cleansing diet. Green tea might not be food that you can eat, but it is still considered to be one of the best choices when it comes to choosing consumable items to help cleanse the liver. The catechins in green tea, for example, can help the liver function more efficiently. It is, however, Important to note that green tea should be enjoyed as the name suggests, like tea, and not be used as an extract when utilized for its liver detoxification benefits. Finally, we would also like to note that lemons are also essential for keeping the liver clean. Lemons are high in vitamin C, which is a natural antioxidant that can help the body with the syncretization of toxins to make the toxins water absorbable. Lemons are also high in phosphorus, fiber, magnesium, iron, copper flavonoids and more, all of which are beneficial for the entire human body. The liver serves an important purpose in the human body, but due to the significant pressure it works under, it is prone to a toxin buildup. The toxins that accumulate in the liver can reduce its efficiency and cause numerous symptoms to develop, including high-fiber foods that are rich in antioxidants are an excellent way to flush toxins out of your liver and to keep it clean. WebMD, the liver nourish holistic nutrition, 10 signals your liver needs to detox consumer health digest, 15 foods that naturally detox and cleanse the body to milk, what's the best apple for a liver cleanse. Authority Nutrition, 12 proven health benefits of avocado consumer health digest, a high fiber diet for jumpstart weight loss. Julie McCormick, Julie McCormick is a writer and co-owner of the Cleveland Leader, a Technorati top 1000 site. Read full profile. Have you ever noticed that some people are able to effortlessly remember even the most mundane details and quickly comprehend new things? Well, you can too. Learning how to improve memory isn't as difficult as you might think. To unlock the full potential of your brain, you need to keep it active and acute. Wasting time on your couch watching mindless television shows or scrolling through social media is not going to help. Besides getting out flashcards. What can you do to help remember things better and learn new things more quickly? Check out these 10 effective strategies on how to improve memory. Physical activities don't just exercise the body, but it also helps to exercise your brain. Obesity and the myriad of diseases that eventually set in as a result of being overweight can cause serious harm to the brain. So when learning how to improve memory, exercise is king. Furthermore, without regular exercise, plaque starts to build up in your arteries and your blood vessels begin to lose the ability to regulate blood flow. Plaque buildup reduces the amount of oxygen and nutrients that your blood carries to your brain. When the nutrients don't make it there, the brain's ability to function is compromised. One study in particular found that exercising four hours after learning significantly improved memory retention. The researchers suggested that appropriately timed physical exercise can improve long-term memory and highlight the potential of exercise as an intervention in educational and clinical settings. To improve your memory, make sure you get moving every day, even if it's just a brisk walk. 
It'll help you maintain and increase your mental acuity. Brisk walking, swimming, and dancing are all excellent activities. If you have trouble finding time to fit in a workout, check out this article, 5 Ways to Find Time for Exercise. Any risk factors that cause you major stress, like anger or anxiety, will, in time, begin to eat away the parts of your brain that are responsible for memory. Amongst the most brain-damaging stressors is depression, which is actually often misdiagnosed as a memory problem since one of its primary symptoms is the inability to concentrate. One study assessed memory in 3,999 veterans and found that depressive symptoms, without anxiety, had an adverse effect on immediate recall of new information and the total amount, but not rate, of acquisition. If you can't concentrate, then you might feel like you are constantly forgetting things. Depression increases the levels of cortisol in your bloodstream, which elevates the cortisol levels in the brain. Doctors have found that increased cortisol diminishes certain areas of the brain especially the hippocampus, which is where short-term memories are stored. Prolonged depression can thus destroy your brain's ability to remember anything new. Seek professional help to combat your depression and any stressors causing it, your brain will thank you. Getting a consistent 7-8 to eight hours of sleep each night will help you in your task of learning how to improve memory. During sleep, the brain firms up memories of recently acquired information, especially during REM sleep. Getting enough sleep will help you get through the full spectrum of nocturnal cycles that are essential to optimal brain and body functioning during the waking hours. On the contrary, sleep deprivation can put a huge dent in your ability to form memories. Another helpful strategy is to take a nap during the day, especially after learning something new. This can also help you to retain those memories, as well as recharge your brain and keep it sharper longer. However, the length of your nap is also very important. Scientists, in one study, found that people who napped for 30 to 90 minutes experienced better word recall. 50 to 60 percent of the brain's overall weight is pure fat, which is used to insulate its billions of nerve cells. The better insulated a cell is, the faster it can send messages, and the quicker you can think. This is precisely why parents are advised to feed their young children whole milk and to restrict dieting. Their brains need fat to grow and work properly. Skimping on fats can be devastating, even to the adult brain. Thus, eating foods that contain a healthy mix of fats is vital for long-term memory. Some excellent food choices include fish, especially anchovies, mackerel, and wild salmon, and dark, leafy green vegetables. Deep-fried foods obviously contain fat, but their lack of nutritional value is not going to help your brain or your body. So think healthy foods and fats first. According to Larry McCleary, M.D., author of the Brain Trust Program. An egg is the ideal breakfast. Eggs contain B vitamins, which help nerve cells burn glucose, antioxidants that protect neurons against damage, and omega-3 fatty acids that keep nerve cells firing at optimal speed. If you want to learn how to improve memory, breakfast is incredibly important. Other foods to add to your breakfast include fruits, veggies, and lean proteins. Avoid trans fats and high fructose corn syrup. Trans fats diminish the brain cell's ability to communicate with each other. And one study found that HFCS can actually damage the brain by promoting brain insulin resistance. Having a healthy breakfast in the morning has been shown to improve performance throughout the day. Don't skimp on this important meal. Nowadays, it's fairly uncommon to write down notes with a pen and paper. When we go to class or meetings, we take our laptops and use that to mark down important ideas. However, recent research has suggested that maybe doing this more harm than good. One 2014 study found that even when laptops are used solely to take notes, they may still be impairing learning because their use results in shallower processing. You can start a journal, write yourself emails, or even start keeping a blog. All of these activities will help to improve your capacity to remember and memorize information. Most importantly, if you're going to class or to a big meeting, Consider taking notes by hand instead of on your computer. Research shows that certain types of music are very helpful in recalling memories. Information that is learned while listening to a particular song or collection can often be recalled by thinking of the song or playing it mentally. Songs and music can serve as cues for pulling up particular memories. If you're looking into learning how to improve memory, this can be a great thing to try.
Listening to music has been shown to specifically benefit the memorization of words. One study found that young adults who listen to music while memorizing a list of words, as opposed to listening to environmental sounds or silence, performed better when asked to recall the words. Next time you have to memorize a speech of want to compete in a spelling bee. Try listening to music while studying. You may be surprised by how much it helps. Pay attention to photographers, charts and other graphics that might appear in your textbook, or if you're not studying a book. Try to pull up a mental image of what it is you are trying to remember. It might also help to draw your own charts or figures. Or utilize colors and highlighters to group related ideas in your notes. Another strong visualization technique for memory is the memory palace. This essentially involves imagining a place you know well, your house or a former school. For example, listing distinctive features of the place in your mind. And begin to associate those features with things you want to remember. Then, when you need to recall information, you simply go the specific room or object where you stored the information in your mind. And it will come to you. For more information on how to build a memory palace, check out this article, How to Build a Memory Palace to Remember More of Everything. Reading material out loud has been shown to significantly improve memory of the material. Expanding further upon this idea is the fact that psychologists and educators have found that by having students teach new concepts to others, it helps to enhance understanding and recall. One study pointed out that this increased memory specifically because it forced students to recall the information in order to teach it. Teach new concepts and information to a friend or study partner. And you'll find you remember the information a lot better. Studies have shown that doing crossword puzzles, reading, or playing cards on a daily basis helps to delay memory loss. Especially in those who experience cognitive decline in the form of dementia. So, pick up the daily newspaper and work on that crossword puzzle. Read a book. Or enjoy a game of solitaire if you want to boost your memory. Everyone has the ability to learn how to improve memory and boost their brain power. And everyone will find that different strategies work for them. Try out some of the above in order to get a feel for what works for you. Current biology, physical exercise performed 4 hours after learning improves memory retention and increases hippocampal pattern similarity during retrieval archives of clinical neuropsychology, the effects of depression and anxiety on memory performance sleep medicine, memory. Sleep and dreaming, experiencing consolidation Johns Hopkins Medicine, can a nap boost brain health. Current neuropharmacology, impact of dietary fats on brain functions nutrients, dietary omega-3 fatty acid deficiency and high fructose intake in the development of metabolic syndrome. Brain metabolic abnormalities. And non-alcoholic fatty liver disease psychological science, the pen is mightier than the keyboard, advantages of longhand over laptop note taking music I scientii, the positive effect of music on source memory applied cognitive psychology, the learning benefits of teaching, a retrieval practice hypothesis J in neurocycle SOC, association of crossword puzzle participation with memory decline in persons who develop dementia. Text source, lifehack.org.